Hey guys, welcome to Circle Group. Hope everyone's been having a pretty good week as we near the end of our school week. All right, you know the routine, the usual. Yes. First, we'll talk about the calendar. Next, Next we'll discuss the weather. And yes. last, as always, we're gonna do something a little different. different. So we're gonna talk about holiday. holiday. Do you know what holiday is coming up this weekend? Yeah, this weekend we have Father's Day. Father's Day. So we're gonna talk about that at the end of our group. Let's get started. All right, let's take a look at our calendar here. It looks like we're about halfway through this month. So what? what month is it and what year is it? Yep, our month is June. If you're looking at your device, the icon for June. Looks very similar to the one for Father's Day. That's a little trick. All right, and our year, yep, is 2020. Very good. All right, now I want you to look at these black boxes and find the next day that does nice. not have a black box on it. And tell me, what is the date and what is the day of the week? Yeah, the date is One, eight, the 18th. Very good. Then we're going to go up with our finger, up with our cursor. And our day of the week is Thursday. Thursday. Very good. And yeah, we have Father's Day coming up. And then what's happening on Saturday? Yeah, it's the start of summer. It's probably been feeling like summer, but now it's official. Right. Now all together, let's say today's date. All right, today's date is Thursday, June 18th, 2020. Thursday, June 18th, 2020. A couple days before summer starts. All right. All right, very nice job. And now I want you all to take a minute to look out the window or look at an app and tell me what, what the weather. what the weather is today. What weather? Tell me the temperature or what it looks like. Yeah, it's definitely hot. another hot day if you're going outside. And it is also a little bit cloudy. cloudy. So you may not need those sunglasses outside today. All right, very good. All right, now we're gonna read a book about Father's Day. All right, Father's Day. Today is Father's Day. I love my dad. Now, as we read this book, I want you to know that if you do not have a father in your life, there's plenty of other people that you can think of when we're reading this book. You could think of, your uncle, if you have an uncle, you could think of grandfather. a grandfather, if you have a grandfather, or you could even think of a friend. So anybody that's an older aged man, if it's not a father, it might be someone that's like a father to you. So you can think of them as we go on. Father's Day is in June. 
It is a special holiday. We show dad how much we care. Gifts. We make cards for dad. Dad likes our handmade cards. Can you find the card? Right there. Yeah, have you ever made a card for your dad? Or something else? We make art for dad. We get him a gift. What do you think your dad or grandfather or uncle or friend would like? Hmm, I got for my dad. I made him some bowls that I painted and then a frame of us. We do chores. We help dad. Do you ever help around the house? A special day. We let dad sleep late. Dad works very hard. What do you think? Do you like to let dad sleep, sleep in a little bit? At least on Father's Day? We go out for brunch. We get dad's favorite foods. What? What are your dad's favorite foods? Hmm. I know my dad really likes subs. That's one of his favorite foods. My dad likes sports. We go to the park. We play baseball. Does your dad like to play any sports with you? Do you guys have favorite games. games that you play? We visit uncles and grandfathers. Oh, see, so some people, if they don't have their father in their life, they'll visit a grandfather or an uncle. So people do celebrate Father's Day in different ways. What do you do to celebrate Father's Day? The end. Yeah, so people celebrate Father's Day Different. With different people, it may not be their father, and in different ways. What I wanted to show you guys are different crafts that you can yeah. do that you can make if you want to give a gift. Let's take a look. Ooh, so this first one is you could decorate a pot, you could cover it in glue, and then wrap yarn around it to make it colorful. If you don't have any yarn, you could also just plant a pot like this, or uh, plant different plants in a pot. So I have here a little cactus. You could decorate it, but you don't have to. You could also make a card. Get a piece of paper, fold it in half, add some stickers, and sign your name. Oh, if your dad wears, if your dad yeah. wears glasses, then you could also make him a special case. Or you use some felt, close it up to make it into a case. You can add a decoration like a dog on the outside. You can make him a box, something tiny to hold things. You can make him a mug even a mouse pad. There are all sorts of things that you can do to create a gift for your dad. What do you think? Do you think you're gonna make a card maybe? All right, well, whatever you do, I hope you have fun making it and that you have a great time celebrating your, Memorial oops, Day. not Memorial Day. celebrating Father's Day. Father's Day this weekend. So I hope you have a great time on Father's Day. Maybe you guys will eat something good and maybe you'll play a fun game. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye.